Hello everyone, I am Dr. Kashir Prince and you are watching Prince Education TV and we are learning how to edit the thesis. You know the thesis without uh, figures and pictures like figures, pictures, tables, it's not complete. So we will add uh, pictures and tables today in today's lecture and we will make a list of table and list of figures. So, how we will have to add the th uh, table is a very simple way. You can just add it uh, uh, in the insert. You will add the table and you can select any type of table. Actually, we are uh, I am uh, teaching the uh, final settings. There are a the lot of the options in the table editing and table uh, settings. This will be taught in the future. Uh, in the different lecture in which we will in, we will discuss the word uh, excel and uh, powerpoint presentation one or you can say microsoft office in detail so stay tuned and uh, uh, subscribe our channel so that you can uh, get the latest videos so uh, in this video i am just uh, teaching you the final settings so uh, we have added the table and uh, for making the automatic uh, list of table you have to add the captions to it in the way i am teaching you you have you cannot write that uh, if you if here and you can just go and table number one you cannot do like that so how you have to label it you have to insert it like a captions so what you have to do you have to click on that cross when you when you move your cursor on the table you will have this cross on the table on the upper right uh, left upper left, left side of the table you just click on it the table is selected then you will put the cursor on the same place and then you will click right click you will do right click and there is an insert caption there is a one option another option is on the table uh, layout but this is a simple way you can just select it here and you will insert the caption so the caption is table one okay so uh, we can say test table and we will click okay so you can see uh, it, it's it's appearing here as this but this is not our uh, uh, according to our thesis style so what we have to do there are the two options one is uh, directly select it and edit from here like uh, times of new roman and then you will click on 12 and then you will move to the reference style uh, sorry you will select it and tell it you will select times of new roman 12 italic and uh, then its color should be black which is not black so we have done like that you can just go here and on insert caption insert caption modify update caption to the matching to match selection you can click here and you can see the caption is edited this is one way and I will tell you another way we will do uh, we will just undo here okay so it is uh, it appears like that the second way is directly go to the caption style like caption and modify it like as I told you I have mentioned so how you do you will click on modify uh, again you will just click uh, the style section and you will uh, click here to, uh, on the arrow and the pop-up will appear you can see you can just see the uh, select the caption you will do right click then modify and then you will modify it as i told you earlier so 12 times of new roman no italic and its color will be black and you will go in the paragraph section and in the paragraph the first line should not be special and line spacing should be single and everything will remain like that and you will click ok and you will see the table is labeled 
so this is table number one for example we want to add another table here and uh, we will go to the insert and we will insert a table and then on the cross we will click on the cross and then right click and then we will insert caption that will be table 2 then there will be table 2 or test table so we will add ok and you will see that it will appear in the modified form when we, we have and, uh, edited the caption style so this is table 2 and we can add, add the figures and we will go to we can add figures like uh, there are the two ways of uh, adding the figures here one is insert and you can add the pictures and you can select your pictures for example uh, I will go to the desktop uh, desktop and I will take this picture for example and picture is added it's a one way okay let's add its caption and then we'll move to the forward you will click right click here and insert captions and it will be it's a table so you you do not want to add the table you will change the label into the figure and it's a figure one okay figure one and then you will just uh, add test figure and you will click on ok and you can see there will be appearance of the caption under it ok so the another uh, method of uh, uh, adding the picture is directly drag and drop method you can just select the picture and you will just add it, directly drag it here like uh, this is a picture for example and we are going to drag on it and we will just add it here and it is added you can see the picture is added so you can just uh, add another caption to it like on the picture right click insert caption this is figure 2 and ok this is called the test figure and we will click on ok so another method uh, which is uh, like uh, you will go on the picture and you will copy it ok right click and then you will copy it copy and you come on the word and you can just paste it. paste it so you can add the pictures in any case any method you can you feel easy so inside caption this is figure 3 and okay its name will be test figure 3 for example and we will click on okay so we are done for our picture edition and uh, the table so what is next we are going to make the list of table and list of uh, pictures this is a table of content and here we want to add the list of figures for example list of list of tables we want to add list of tables here so what we will go uh, do we will go to the references and in the reference sections we, you will see the insert table of figures table of figures so again we were at home and we will go to the references and in the references you will say insert table of figures so we selected the table of figures we will select this uh, uh, table and then you can say this is uh, uh, this is list of tables and here the list of figures is appearing so what we will do we will change into the list of tables and then you will click ok and you will see the list of table is appearing here the table one was on page number two and table uh, two was on page number three so in the next page okay you will do what you will do it's not done properly like uh, this is not edited properly what's the what's the problem 
you tell me yes it was added by the space or the enter so what we will have to do we have to insert a uh, section break section break next page so that the list of figures will appear or will always appear on the next page okay so we will just uh, do so you can say list of tables and then we will have a section break here and we will add another section break here so that a list of uh, figures will appear on the next page so page break and in the next page and you can see this is appearing on the next page uh, yes and here we will add list of figures list of figures and uh, you will go to the references again and in the references you will go to the insert table of figures and in the insert table of figures you will go to the caption label and in the caption label you will select the table you will click ok cancel it's not doing in the right way put your cursor here here and you will do insert uh, figures you will click ok and you can see it is added as a figure figure 1 was on page number 4 2 so you do not need to add the page numbers manually so uh, what's the magic I will show the, you the magic I will copy these two these two uh, these three paragraphs control C and we will add here control V control V control V it means that I have added it many pages on it so if you come on the table of content you can see it is 1 6 11 and uh, you see 2 3 and uh, the list of figures 4 6 7 so now i will show you the magic i will right click here and i will click on the update field and in the update field i will see the entire table and i will click on ok so you can see the introduction was on table number one and review of literature is shifted to 11 and material method is shifted to 16 so also so again the table of list of figures so we will do so let me uh, let me select it already yes it, it's already changed so it's already changed so you can see that with just one click with just one click you can edit your table of content very easily so up till now we have completed most of the portion of thesis editing in the next lectures we will uh, edit uh, we will tell you how to edit the title page and after that uh, hopefully we have completed the main um, portion of the thesis editing if you have any question you can ask us and if you have a specific uh, word or any microsoft office related problem you can just comment under the picture under the video so that we can make a tutorial according to your needs